<laughs> Welcome to this week's newsletter video. If they're not, they're not on each. <laughs> this is Michael Patterson. Michael, how would you rate your driving, Michael? Not your car driving. Erratic. 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 <laughs> yeah. What's your handicap index? Too much. Too much. Twen was it? 20 plus. North, Gee, north of 20. North of 20. I was 12 once. No, I know. When was that, 1970? Yes. Yeah, thought so. Yes. Thought so. Anyway, Michael's a great laugh. Don't go out drinking with me and Michael, though, because Michael uh, had a nasty accident, but we're not going to go into that at the moment. Pain we're to down. here to test the... That's not it, actually. The, the 10K Max by Ping, the most forgiving driver on the planet, allegedly. Up to now. And we're going to find out if it's forgiving because Michael <laughs> needs more forgiveness than a naughty schoolboy. Okay. So prepare for some hilarity during this. I've told him not to swear and no non PC stuff. So here we go. So <clears throat> the 10K Max. Now, before we test the 10K Max with Michael, we're going to watch what he does with his own driver. Be prepared. And no sniggering. I will not snigger. Right. Give me that. <coughs> right, so this is your own driver. It's one driver. Hit away, please. <sighs> Straightish. Pre predominant shot is a cut. <sighs> a power feed. <laughs> power feed, that's a cut. That's not as much a feed as that, but hey ho. That's all right. Right, peg another one down. Yeah, that's. Now. I was actually up at it's also worth noting that Michael has a new hip. I've got two now. Oh, he's got two hips. Got two hips. Two new hips? Two new hips. Well, one was 10 year old. But I've got one was 10 year old. Matching. Did, did you trade it in? Yes, yeah. Did, yeah. <laughs> we buy any hip, Doc? <laughs> <laughs> oh, hip, hip, hip. Right. I'm just going to put that ball oh, in the <laughs> right position for you. Okay. <laughs> we buy any hip. <laughs> I'm going to use that one again. Well, definitely, that's, a, that's right. yeah, yeah. There's mileage in that one. Right, on yeah. you go. Jeez. Oh, oh, I see a bit of hip hip here. Yep. All right. <laughs> oh, better. Ah, you'd be happy with that. <laughs> Smashed through the 200 yard barrier. Well done. Only 120 behind Fraser. Whoa. <laughs> Right, just bang that one out of the no, way. Don't go that far, my holdies. <laughs> oh, no, no. Oh. I don't know, it's a ten and a half degree loft this, but I don't get a lot of, I don't get a lot of height in it. Stand too close, aren't you? Right. Okay. Right. Jesus, that was... I would say you're reasonably warmed up. Slash. <laughs> slash. Oh, 195. Aye, I'm trying to cure this uh, killer slice because you use a hell of a distance, just spins it. Oh, the okay. first 150 looks good, and that was in the last, it spins. Yeah. You lose so much distance and ends up behind a tree somewhere, invariably. <laughs> so. Well, with the, with the storms, there's not many trees. Well, true enough, aye. So, I did actually, that was, I did actually request that from the big man. Did I you? Aye. <laughs> I only got a full season to go this year <laughs> after being uh, reduced last year. So, so we're going to let you try the 10k max. Obviously, the marketing hype is there, saying this is the most forgiving driver on the planet. Was. Uh, was. Yes. <laughs> so, again, like the tailor made, we've got uh, forgiveness across the face and up and down the face, right? Let's see. What's, put, that, what's that shaft, is it, Matt? I've just put a 65 regular in to right, start with, right. okay? Uh, just to see. I've also, this is a. A 45 inch shaft opposed to a 40, uh, 45 and three quarter, almost 46. <laughs> What's it in the middle? What are you saying? Middle face? Just, whatever, just, just do what you it, normally do. Right. We're not, we're not, we're not oh, trying to. What's the problem? <laughs> well, we're seeing if this will help you. <laughs> what improvement? <laughs> Don't do as I do. Do as I say. <laughs> Hint of hint of straightness. A hint of straightness. Okay. Twenty so, yards. It's off my own one. Didn't feel any. Right. Didn't, I, didn't actually feel any sweeter a strike, mind you. It was the, <coughs> well, that that is the the reason. 
right? So when it's not as sweet a strike, because the, the no. driver head is a high MOI, it doesn't twist as much, mm -hmm. okay? So that's probably well, what you Brian, that's when I, watched, I watched last week's video. Or and that's what he said, Brian was saying it? that, it was the same thing. He said, I thought it was repeat mode, he kept saying, every shot he hit. No, you didn't. Well, <laughs> see, to be fair, that's the, that's the miracle of editing. <laughs> <laughs> right, <laughs> on you go. But that's true. <laughs> There's some of the things, it's a nice, a nice smell, a nice sound of it, that was, hence the name. Yeah, I think I'm standing a bit too close, but anyway. Right. So again, sounded kind of harsh, so maybe low point on the, on the face a little bit lower, but again. Oh, that's, yep, yeah, that's, I think right. that's the face. That's, that's Let's look at your numbers. Okay. <sighs> So, 36, 24, 36. <laughs> it's quite difficult sometimes uh, fitting uh, people with uh, as much madness as yourself. So, uh, this, this, could, this could take a while. <laughs> right, so. Much editing required. <laughs> Michael, the reason why you hit a, a slice as such is because your path is 8.8 .8 degrees out to in. Now, you could hit it a lot further, uh, but you hit down on it as well. Okay, so a recipe for slicing and a lack of distance. Mm -hmm. However, um, the last two shots you've hit, one you hit in the middle, one slightly towards the toe, the toe hit will help you because the ball will start to tilt a little bit to the left, uh, but that's for an inward toe strike, an mm -hmm. outward toe strike, that's gonna shoot right. But this is why it's forgiving. Uh, the numbers there, 198, 215. So again, we're not changing your swing today, we're just seeing if the, yeah. It's a spin. If the it's driver. Can try and control the spin a bit, or no? Well, the spin there. The, that's the thing. Well, look at the spin, yeah. but because you hit down on the ball, the spin is going to be higher. Okay. Is that a fact? So I'm going to try and Just do me lift the shoulder down. and try and lean back a bit. I felt a better, well, sweeter strike. Uh huh. <sighs> 215, well that's probably kind of, well, it was probably kind of normal anyway, I think. Okay, so that was your <coughs> strike there. So right in the middle. Okay, so you did feel it. Right. I did, the, feel, the, the I did one, feel better. Yeah. yeah, so if you look at the last two, so with the strike not as centred, 198, pretty consistent numbers compared to your own. 168, 187, 180, 203 carry, 198, 201. Pretty extra, decent. Six or twenty yards in the ah in the carry. You, you, you just try different things. That the the benefit of using technology that we're using today is the fact that you can try things and, and <coughs> measure. Yeah. If you don't measure, you're just going to be guessing. Nah, so I know what's well. That's everybody goes away from a driver and he's going, oh, "I've got a feeling." I've got a feeling. I know. I know. And then they go yeah. to the course and it's it's not. That means nothing. To, unless no. you do it out there. So if you do the th same thing again, you look at your numbers, change your numbers, yeah. and you've got uh, you've got evidence. Okay, so mm -hmm. let's hit again. Okay, chocolate. <coughs> Slightly off centre. Oh, I don't think I've ever seen you hit three straight on track. I try to give it to try to give it the beans here, which is not always a good thing, but So the key thing for Michael is getting some forgiveness. In more ways than one. For Mrs. Patterson. For Mrs. Usually. Patterson, usually, yes. yes. So, <coughs> this is why this club has come to market because it does offer massive forgiveness. The hype has been massive about it. Had a fitting yesterday with a guy that, how can I put it, a very high speed player. Hates seeing the ball go left. Uh, so, what we did was we put this head, uh, big, strong. Uh, X shaft. We made the shaft longer because sometimes the, the guy's bad shot was more towards the toe, which made the ball go to the left. But even with this driver hitting it in the same position that he was hitting it in his G430 Max driver, it didn't tilt as much to the left. So that is again the higher MOI. The ball isn't tilting as much off this head. So if you can tilt the ball Quite considerably, this could be a driver that you would think about getting fitted into. I have a question. Also, there's more people that are more consistent, more handicappers will see uh -huh. more, more 
they'll feel a benefit. I was I felt okay to me, but I'm just saying with that in theory, does that suit does it does it suit all golfers that really aimed at See to be honest, well the guy yesterday is a single figure handicapper yeah. and he hits the ball a long way. Mm -hmm. So and it his strike's pretty good. It's mm -hmm. it's not as inconsistent as yourself. Mm -hmm. So no, it's a driver head that, that works for a lot of people. Um I th the main thing is forgiveness. Um mm -hmm. and for for you that no, is that's a, that's a that's a major. If you go out and don't lose a ball on a golf course, yeah. then your handicap comes down automatically. Mm -hmm. So that would be that would be the end goal, I would say, for mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. Now, with re regard to the coaching, yes, a little bit of coaching. But if we did nothing with you in mm -hmm. coaching and gave you this head, mm -hmm. what fun that was! I think we would see a, was, a, a big difference. A, quite a character. I finally found my match when it comes to uh, jokes. Uh, but anyway, the the main purpose of the the fitting was to take somebody who, Michael won't mind me saying this, is considered quite wild off the tee, uh, a reel across the the ball path which can cause some serious uh, curvature. Uh, Michael does tend to hit it off centre in the club face quite a bit. The shorter shaft did help. We did try other shafts, stiffer, heavier, lighter, uh, but we really didn't get anything close to the to the numbers we got with the 65 s 45 in shaft as you can see the ball speed increase was was massive uh because it is forgiving uh and he did use the face generously didn't you michael uh but again you can see the increase in distance and the ball just didn't tilt as much to the right as it did with the his own driver you can see those figures in the side spin uh, so much better, so much better uh, for Michael. I've, as I say, I've never seen him hit three uh, straighter shots. Um, again, if you do hit all over the club face and you do cut the ball uh, quite a bit, then you've seriously got to consider this uh, as something that would help you. So, hope you found that interesting and more comedy to come. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. It was uh, non-stop fun. Michael is a heck of a heck of a personality, but you did see the difference. You could see, I think, in the future videos, what I would do is I would record the uh, the video image as well, so I can show you the exact. It's maybe a wee bit too difficult to see the start line of the ball from the video, but much straighter, much further. Uh, it does exactly what it says in the tin. Does that make it good for you? We don't know until we try, okay? One more little bit of news for you. Uh, we have a special birthday at the club this week. I've just bumped into a rowdy table of gentlemen uh, in the clubhouse. Alan Cuthbertson, happy 70th. Don't you look great? Don't you look great? And if you don't believe me, here's a picture of him looking great. So if you're interested in trying the Ping 10K Max, even against the TaylorMade QI10 Max, then give us a shout. And until next week, I've had lots of fun. I've been Graham Bell. Salute.